All right, here's another video. I got my friend Bob ordered a pair of hi hat cymbals that um, he got them from a collector in California. Not a, I've never heard of him, but th these cymbals were supposedly used by um, who used them for a long time. They were Jim Keltner's hi hat cymbals that he had for a long time. Even though he's a Peisty guy, he had these 14s. They're they're like 1960 Avita Zildjian hi hat. You know, before New Beats. Uh, so Keltner had them for a long time. He got them from. Um, who was the guy? Um, the guy with the Octoplus kit, the first Octoplus. God love him. He's a great drummer. plays on all that 60s stuff. I can't even think of his name. It's such a melon head. Um, Hal Blaine. Got him from Hal Blaine. They were such... These symbols were like the ultimate recording symbols. Well, are, because I have them right here. 14-inch um, new beats. Well, before they were new beats. They just called them hi-hats. They're medium thin. I haven't taken them out yet. Um, anyway, Keltner sold them this collector... Who like supposedly had them in a safe and stuff, like deadpan. Like these are like these symbols are like sought after. Supposedly, if you ask Vinnie Kaliud and some of these name guys, they're like symbols they used to actually I think move around from studio to studio. So supposedly they, they EQ great and they're just a lot. You know what they were used on? They were used on. Um, I think Dire Straits used them on uh, Sultan's a Swing. You know that really great hi hat sound you hear. Um, all that again, all that '60s stuff, a lot of Keltner stuff. Um, supposedly, and I, I don't know if this is true, but they were used on, um, Stuart Copeland used them when they were recording, uh, the second record, because apparently his roadie knew, uh, Keltner or something, so he brought them for the second record, so supposedly the symbols you hear on, uh, on Walking on the Moon, and on, um, I think that most of those songs on that record are in this bag, so you'll see here, Came in. <laughs> no knife or scissors. Alrighty. Do not open without consult from Andy somebody. Well, I'm opening them. So these are. This better be. How the hell do you open this thing? Yeah. So yeah, I've been, like I said, in all the videos, I've been opening. Oh, I feel I feel like I got a golden ticket. I've got it. You know what I mean? Look at these things. These are definitely. 